versus Jewel. But Benny is a completely different beast. In Jewel, we saw how he was able to lock him down in the corner. Ramen, kind of a slow character, but Greninja, anything but. He is one of the most mobile characters in the game, to the point where it's going to be a lot harder for Utopian Ray to actually keep him in the corner. Instead, it's probably going to have to be with, uh, you know, just getting off of the, a lot off of the hits he managed to find. Guys playing pretty safe, throwing out moves, but okay, but I said that many kind of gets hit by a grenade. Oh, that was so good. Just reacting to that Wonder Wing. Wonder Wing, like immediately out of a single hit, like to break out a disadvantage. Shockingly good, as we've seen Utopian Ray do quite a few times. I love that. The down beat to stall him. Then he was looking for an air dodge in that situation, and that was such a cute little defensive option. Both of these guys are at no percent, but it's gonna be Venia to take the first stop. And only at 95%, Banjo does have kill power, but against Venia, it's not likely that he's gonna be just getting one of his raw kill moves. Perhaps forward air could be a really good answer to those full hops that Venia just in general likes to do. Greninja having so much vertical uh, speed with his fastball and his air speed. Oh wow, that was so smart. And he came down at the perfect angle. Alright, finally that stock being taken. Utopian Ray, maybe not in the greatest position in the world, but he seems to be doing quite alright for himself. Oh, only the first of the up smash hit. But that time, Foyer is still not enough. Banjo is a very heavy character, as we're seeing surviving at the most crucial of times. Uh, but that one, yeah, down tilt, forward air, there's no way you're surviving that against, uh, at, the, at least at that part of the stage. Topian Ray slowing things down just a bit, getting chip damage here and there with his grenades. And for the most part, uh, it seems that, well, if we're gonna look at Utopian Ray's, uh, how he's been acting at disadvantage, it seems like the two biggest things that he's doing are grenade and his Wonder Wing. And those two things are polar opposites, where if you're Venia and you, if you think that uh, Ray is going to, oh, dang. If you think that Ray is going to go for, you know, a grenade pull, you can go up there to meet him. You can, you know, challenge him on it. However, if he's going to Wonder Wing, you have to respect that. So far, for the most part, Utopian Ray has been uh, playing that pretty well, just guessing right on those 50-50s. He's getting stuck on these platforms, and Venia, it's amazing how he's able to dash back and forth underneath the platform and still exert pressure because of how quickly Greninja can, you know, get up there with a back air. Oh, this could be huge damage for... <gasps> this is actually an even game right now, and you saw how he beautifully just barely missed getting hit by that forward smash. A back throw won't finish the stock, I don't think, but 133, 35%. Actually, lose some stage control for a grenade pull that might come back to haunt him. Oh wow, what a! He needs to. Oh, that was so good from Vania. So Banjo still has an infinite recovery. He could have come back from that. So he, recognizing that, just goes out there to meet him, uh, and he was pretty much forced to get hit. Because if you wanted to, I think he maybe he could have air dodged, but then he would be too low, and there was be no way for him to recover at that point. So, just absolutely fantastic endgame right there from Venia. Especially considering the fact that, uh, Tokyo was making that comeback. Absolutely making that comeback. Alright, no stage switch. Just running it back immediately. Okay. Oh no! 
all right. Yeah, you can't be too comfortable. A lot of characters, you know, Greninja included, has like a little check thing. They just, you know, somebody's off stage, low commitment. There's no way I can get punished for this, you know, little shuriken. But you have to remember, Banjo can absolutely punish that. Wonder Wing is just such a... It's such an interesting move. It's kind of ridiculous, yes. But at the same time, it, it does have its inherent balance. Right, these two are neck and neck in percents, but neither of them are quite at the point where you know, they really have to be worried about dying. And it's such an interesting, like, I, it's such interesting how they play the game at that point. Oh, I stand corrected. I forgot about Wonder Wing. I think he only has one left charge left, but uh, he took that stock. And that's all he really needed. I think he might even save that last Wonder Wing charge for recovery of some kind. Yep, and I think he's out of Wonder Wings now, which, at the very least, off stage means that, uh... Yeah, off stage he's gonna have a lot more, uh, trouble recovering. And right now, Venny is a little bit desperate to take out the stock with the counter, but going unpunished for it. You took anyway, seeing it a very cool 138%, 148 after the back and that was still not enough to take it. And yep. the Wonder Wing, the lack, or rather the lack thereof, not being able to save him from, um the depths of the stage. Now Venny is sitting at 77%, and when you're a low combo character like Greninja, like this isn't exactly that big of a hill to climb because all you need is like one falling neutral, like one dash attack. Look at that, waiting from one falling there, that's 21%, and you have put Banjo Kazooie in a ledge trap scenario, and he, <gasps> that was so, so dangerous. Oh, that was so smart. That was yep. so good. Because that was the only way he could really punish that. Yep. If he had shielded it there, there would have been no way for him to get back in time. But uh, Ray, he... ready to call out the jump with the forward or just, like, not That's actually that the that second time he's gotten that. Yep. So that's something that Venia has to be really careful about. Mm -hmm. Just those forward airs, a real... What those... What uh, Banjo forward air is so good at doing is punishing you for being at that full hop height. Yep. Who getting the down tilt into up smash, putting Ray at 108%, but still hitting, hitting Venya with the Wonder Wing. And it's crazy, like, I can see Ray going with these really, really aggressive Wonder Wing options and still being able to connect through with it on so many different amazing opponents. But getting the down tilt into Florida, not enough to take it quite yet. Venya trying to dip low, forcing a little bit of a lower recovery, because if he went high, that would have surely been the back end. All right, that down tilt forward air will get the kill. It's, it's so hard to play around all of Greninja's kill setups yep. at higher percents. But uh, that's quite a few times I think he's gotten hit by the down tilt forward air. Oh, at those lower percents really where you have to look out for dash attack, that's the one that can just do so much damage to you if you're not careful. Oh, 64%. Venny is piling on the damage and bringing back the deficit from which he came. He was a whole stock down, brought it back to even the back hit, setting Utopian away off stage. <gasps> Ah, oh, trying to get a panic air dodge in, but that's going to be the down throw. And you what a match. Really yeah. That was so good from Venny. It doesn't even... He gets out before the, even the first up tilt was there. Yep. Ooh, landing with the down air. It's so, so <laughs> scary. <laughs> He's going through a very, very specific set. Maybe like down throw, and down air, excuse me, into one of his aerials. <gasps> oh, my. I think he maybe could have recovered, though, still. He maybe could have pulled Ele out a grenade, but... Well, regardless... That will be the 2-0 for Venio. Wow. That was definitely, considering like the tension in that set, that was definitely not the way I was expecting it to end with an upbeat pineapple. Ben do you PS2. think the win box? Uh, do you think the win box pushed him in there? Yes. Yeah. Um, so yeah, if we take a look right over here. <gasps> yep, the whole, yep, the win box pushing him into the sides of PS2. Thus getting him pineapple. And I don't even think he pulled out a grenade in time. Yeah, that I think it was just like, because you have to really yep. be like, ready for that. And who would it be ready for, you know, being... That is such an obscure thing to look out for. Yeah. 